All right, what is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It is Simplistic, and welcome back to another video. Today, I'm here with Destiny, my beautiful girlfriend. And right now, we are in Las, Las Vegas, Vegas. Oh. a city that's full of gambling, fine dining, entertainment, and drinking. Lots of water. Obviously. But the first thing that comes to my mind is all of the grandest hotels that they have to offer here. We are going to be comparing the lowest, most cheapest hotel versus the bougiest, most expensive hotel. We're going to be rating our entire experience and seeing how different they really are. All right, babe, the only real right way to see who gets which hotel is to leave it up to luck because this city is all about betting. Well, obviously, I'm going to win. Why do you say that? Because I have the best luck. You have the best luck? I, I ended up with you. What you mean? Literally everyone in their moms in my comments have been requesting for Destiny to be in a lot more videos, so here she is. I'm back. We got envelope A and B, one with a $100 budget and one with a $10,000 Budget. That's a lot of money. I'm not gonna lie. I love how midway through our intro we just see a security guard going up the escalator like that. He's going crazy. <laughs> Vegas is a pretty scary place. We have our lucky quarter right here. It's literally a 50-50 chance, so anyone can win. And I just want to make sure this is fair, right? That's fair. No complaining, all right? If you lose, you lose. I'm gonna let you have the honors of flipping it. So tails is one hundred dollars. Heads is ten thousand dollars. Are you ready? Look, he's scared, but let's do it. Ready? Go. One, two. Oh, no, bro. How did I know you were going to get to 10K? Like, bro, why can't it just be me for once? For once. I told you it's my luck. I'm low-key a sore loser, but here's your envelope. It's a special envelope. Let's open it up. 10K. It's upside down. I'm not looking forward to this, bro. Of course, it's upside down, just like my mood right now. All right, Destiny, you have $10,000 to spend on your hotel, food, uh, shopping. Okay, okay, relax. But yes, shopping too. And sadly, your boy is gonna have only $100 to get all of that. How am I gonna do that, bro? Remember that one hotel we stood at? Bro, the worst reviewed motel. That's how it can be the oh one you're gonna stay. Bruh. Yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna survive this. All right, babe, this is the last time I'm gonna see you in the next 24 hours. Good luck on your stay. Have fun, be safe. That's pretty much it. Are you at least gonna miss me? I know, but I'm gonna live lavish for the day. <laughs> you don't care. Bye. Oh yeah, wait, hold on. There's a heart right there, so you guys should. Drop a like, subscribe to get him to 2 million. You guys should definitely do that, but now it's time for me to figure out my whole entire situation. I highly doubt there's gonna be a $100 hotel room, so I'm definitely gonna have to start looking at some motels. Oh man, it's not looking too great, but after 15 minutes of looking, I finally found one. Sure, they're not gonna have designer stores, or a nice pool, or a room service. And on top of that, it's literally 30 minutes away from all the hotels here, literally everything. We definitely have to get moving. The Uber there already is like 10 to $15, so that cuts into my budget, man. Hey, I can't. Yo, man, I need you all property right now, man. I need you all property, okay? What are you talking get the about? Off, man. Bro, Wait, relax. Get, get the camera on hey, my hey, face. Relax. Get, get off the get property. Hey, 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 relax. Get off property, Bro, I was man. giving you props over there. Come on, man. We good. We ah, you playing with me? But I'm gonna be staying at the Regency Inn which costs a whopping $50 per night. You know, they call me simplistic for a reason. I live a simple life and I never want really anything extra. I really don't need a lot to make me happy. With that being said, this is all I need. As long as I get a room with a bed in it, I'm chilling. And even with the lower budget, I'm not too down bad right now. Let's head inside the lobby and book our room and see what else they have to offer. Even though Destiny is probably bathing in champagne right now, I'm gonna stay positive throughout all this. First impression walking in, it wasn't anything spectacular, okay, I will admit. But the customer service was A1. That guy was just... He wasn't the most excited, but he he was nice. That's all that really like matters. As long as you're a nice person, that goes a long way. Wi-Fi password is. Do I get free Wi-Fi? Yeah. Let's go. You got free Wi-Fi, baby. This place is lit. And he was really fast with getting my room, so that's a plus. Bro, the key card that they gave me is literally hypnotizing me into thinking this is the best place ever right now. Like, what kind of key card is this, man? Isn't this place awesome? He said it's all right, but I mean, I think it's awesome. Guys, Vegas has tons of different expensive hotels. They have designer stores, the best restaurants, and top tier swimming pools. But after looking, my top choice has to be the Wynn Hotel. All right, y'all, we're heading inside. From what I've seen online, it looks super bougie. Let's go inside. We're barely walking in, and we're already greeted by a Formula One, Heineken, Silver, Las Vegas Grand Prix 2023. Like, look at that. That is so beautiful. Guys, there's literally a garden inside, and it's colorful. Look at it. It reminds me, like, of a Japanese garden, but inside a hotel. Like, what? I wish I could have this in my house one day. Guys, this place is massive. But before we go to our room, let's explore a little bit. Look, there's even a waterfall in here. Um, I don't think this is a pool, but I'm gonna have to make it a pool. Oh my goodness. 
this. I don't think you can actually ride it, but I think it's really pretty. This is gorgeous. Guys, I love horses so much. I actually want a horse when I get older. Guys, we got Dior, Chanel, Louis Vuitton. Usually I cannot afford this stuff, but with my $10,000 budget, I'm gonna go crazy. All right guys, before we get too ahead of ourselves and before we go to Gucci, I actually already cut my budget in half. I got a $5,000 room. They told me I got the most expensive room, so I'm excited. The art in here is exquisite. Since we're in Vegas, we got a lot of machines, but my budget is not going towards that. Ooh, they got chrome hearts, nice. Guys, this hotel never ends. Look at this. That's so sick. And it's spinning. Sheesh. Guys, they even have Herms in here. And they got Saline. And there's more beautiful artwork. I don't really know what it's supposed to be, but it's nice. And they got some sort of owl store. Pretty sure it's like a Wiz Khalifa collab or something like that. I don't know. Look at all these screens. This is prime time entertainment right here. So the room that I'm staying in has its own section and it is through these gold gates. Wow, this is so fancy. I bet every single piece of furniture is worth like a million dollars. All we have to do is walk past this beautiful garden. Right through those doors is a private suite. And I already checked in. Thank you. Thank you. Guys, it's giving Europe. Oh my gosh, look at this design. I might have to take some pictures in here. These elevators feel so exclusive. Like, look at this gold. We're almost there, look. This looks so modern. This is literally how I want my future house. Hold on, it's Noah calling again. Bro, I don't want to talk to you. Goodbye. Okay, I think we are 3806. That is left. All right, guys, I don't know what to expect, but let's find out. And here we are. Let's go, baby. First impression from the outside, nothing too crazy, but let's check it out, man. Okay, that's what I'm talking about. This is fire, bro. This right here is ideal. It's perfect. It's everything that I need. Let's start from left to right. We got these beautiful old fashioned drapes. It kind of looks like I'm in the medieval times. And behind that, my room is actually right next to where all the maids keep their stuff. And the reason I find that cool is because if I'm feeling lonely, I can just go next door and chat it up. Moving on, we got a classic coffee table with an iPhone 15. How do they have this already? Next level technology, we also do have a comfy looking sofa absolutely love the style of it and another mini coffee table this right here is what i'm talking about a giant mirror for me personally it's always important to give myself a little fit check make sure i'm looking good this hotel has my back moving along we got ourselves a nightstand right next to our humongous bed listen i'm just gonna say it my only concern is that this place is rated three stars out of five so hopefully this doesn't have any bed bugs and whenever i'm laying down i can just kind of look to the side and see this beautiful painting it's pretty cool to see that this place also has some usb connections for my phone alongside a wall mounted lamp. It's like they just knew I was coming. For that extra lighting, looks like the one on the other side is actually broken, but that's okay. Now let's talk entertainment because I looked all around this hotel and there's absolutely nothing to do. It's just the desert. Even if I wanted to go meet up with Destiny or enjoy Las Vegas, I can't. Oh. <laughs> Bro, this is insane. This is so nice. This is ginormous. Let me give you guys a little tour. All right, to start off right here, we have a little place to eat. This table itself is probably worth more than me. This is like giving restaurant vibes alone. Like when you sit at a restaurant, the back seat. First off, I wanna say I love the colors in here. We also have these two vintage chairs. I'm sure they're worth a lot. Moving along, we have a painting that fits the entire wall. We have an office right here. This is probably where I'm gonna do all my work stuff and calls. Whoa, and look at probably my favorite part Part, the view. The view is insane. You can see like the entire city. You can also see the swimming pools down there. I would never get tired of this view. Moving on to the living room area. We have two couches and a big huge coffee table. The wind magazine. Hey, we seen that. That was a cool art design. We have a plant and an apple because an apple day keeps the doctor away. All right, here's the bar area. I actually don't drink, but I drink water, so. Oh, I love these cabinets. Look at this. It has a little mirror and three little knobs. I think you pull on them. Oh, there's a little mini fridge in here. Oh, how do you open it? Oh, like a regular fridge. Right here, we have a little tiny snack bar, and if you pick something up, it actually charges you. So we're not gonna pick anything up. I honestly don't even like candy. And some accent plants never hurt. We have these silver little vases that I'm kind of scared to touch. Knowing me, I'd probably break them. Moving along, I think this is the bedroom. It also has double doors. <gasps> Yo, this is where I'm gonna sleep. It has like 
lights on and everything. This already looks so comfortable. We also have another amazing view. What does this button do? All off. I think it turns off the lights. Oh, guys, look at the curtains are closing. Oh my goodness. When I'm sleeping, I just have to click that button. I think it turns everything off. What about the lights? Oh, the master bathroom. You guys, this bathroom is so huge. Look at this mirror. I love the design of this bathroom. These are lamps. I've never seen a lamp anything like this. No way. This is actually a TV. They have a TV in the bathroom. Now going to the shower. I love the colors and it's huge. I'm gonna be taking a long shower tonight. This is definitely giving old fashioned vibes. But I am living for it. Here we got <gasps> the bathroom itself is just crazy. They really have a phone by the toilet. So if you're using the bathroom, you just call anyone. Moving on to this side, we have a huge tub that I'm definitely gonna be using tonight. I love how they have everything set up for me. No way this is real. Whether I'm making YouTube videos, streaming online, or just surfing the web, I wouldn't want some random nerd across the country to just leak my private data. It just couldn't be me. That is why with full confidence, I can say ExpressVPN is the best around. All of your devices have a unique IP address. It's like your internet phone number, and people can use that to find things out about you, like where you live. That's why you need ExpressVPN. For starters, ExpressVPN doesn't log your activity online. Lots of cheap or free VPNs make money by selling your data to advertisers, but ExpressVPN, they don't do that. They even developed a technology called the Trusted Server that makes their servers incapable of storing any data at all. For me, having a VPN nowadays is just as important as having locks on my doors. Next up, let's talk speed. And no, I'm not talking about the speed we all know and love. ExpressVPN now uses Lightweight, a new protocol engineered to make everything faster. And on top of that, it lets me change my online location so I can get thousands of extra shows on Netflix that are only available in other countries, especially like my personal favorite from London, Attack the Block. And on top of that, it is so easy to use. You don't need any technical skills at all. All you have to do is download the app and you're one tap away to connect. And it's not just me saying this. CNET, The Verge, and other tech journals rate ExpressVPN the number one VPN in the world. So make sure to protect yourself by using my link over at expressvpn.com slash simplistic and you can get an extra three months free on a one-year package. <laughs> Be safe out there, kids. Here's our TV remote with our 100-inch flat screen TV. This is what I'm talking about. Maybe later on if I want to throw on some Spongebob, watch a sports game, I'm chilling. A premium coffee maker for all my coffee needs. Whenever I need a boost of energy, I'm definitely going to hit that. Or in the morning if I want to enjoy a cup of joe, this is amazing. We have a lot of drawer space. I'm probably not going to use any of this at all. Oh, okay, an open microwave? That was pretty dope. I definitely think they did that on purpose to make it seem like it was waving hello to me or something. The restroom area is looking pretty clean. We got a mirror on that side and also right here. Just another place they provided me to see how I'm looking. I think we're looking good. The pristine granite countertops is simply just amazing. Accompanied with a modern sink. Now I'm not trying to look wrinkly until I'm old. So we also have an iron for all my clothes. Super clutch even though I just brought these clothes right here. But I mean at least they have it. The place we're going to take all of our number ones and number twos and our showers. It has this thing on it that says sanitize. So at least I know I'm not going to get sick here. Whenever I take a shower I want the water pressure to be really good. And I just feel like it's it's just not going to be good here. What is that bro? Hey but for the price I pay. I really can't complain. At least it works. I didn't bring a single thing to wash my hair or my body, but we got some teeny tiny little face and body bars over here. So I'm chilling. Every single day that I get older, I get a little bit more mature. So I'm really pleased to see that they have an office space for me. One million dollars? Yeah, no. Make it five. That's too much money? Bro, you know who you're talking to? That's it. Make it 10 million or no deal. Oki just got really sad because I don't have a gaming setup to play any video games and this is where I would put it. <laughs> I guess a day wouldn't hurt, man. So I've been here for about an hour and I'm driving myself crazy in this room. I'm extremely bored, but I realize on the way in, they have a luxurious pool. I think that's my best option right now because at least it gives me something to do and it's extremely hot outside. While I'm currently in this awesome room, I kind of wonder what Destiny is up to right now. The pool here looks so grand and beautiful. It's legit so nice outside. All right, so since we're in a fancy suite, I have to match it. And that's more like it. Let me give you guys a quick 360. I just went downstairs and purchased this dress, so that's a little bit off my budget. You know what? My stomach is starting to hurt. I think it's time to get a fancy dinner. I really wonder what my boyfriend's up to right now. I just checked right now and it's over 100 degrees. This is gonna hit different. Wait, there's actually no way. This thing is locked. I can't even get in. 
so much for that, I guess. Since I couldn't go for a swim, I am feeling pretty hungry and there's a gas station across the street. I don't have much more money to spend. I think I only have like 20 more dollars to spend, so that's gonna work great. They even have a Wetzel's Pretzels inside of this place. That's fire. This is an upgraded gas station, probably like level 100 or something. So to start, I think we go ahead and grab ourselves a drink. I've been sweating a lot and I'm mad dehydrated right now. An ice cold blue lemonade, let's go. We'll grab some Chester hot fries. These are fire for only $2 too. Sour punch bites for $3. Got all that, but to finish it off, I have to get a pretzel. Can I get the pizza pretzel bites? And can I also get the jalapeno cheddar? And that'll be it. It'll be $9.55. Cool. Thank you, bro. Have a good one. So there goes all of our money. We have zero dollars to spend now. When I was in high school, I would always go to the mall just for these right here. So it kind of hits home. With the jalapeno cheddar sauce, it's kind of hot. It's really hot. Oh my gosh. This is so good. I'm just going to say it. This meal right here probably tops everything that my girlfriend is doing. On a summer day like this, this right here is it. I'm trying really hard this year not to eat a lot of candy, but I just couldn't resist these. Where I'm currently sitting is actually in the back of the gas station. They actually have a car wash in here, so it's pretty loud. But it's kind of cool hearing all these loud noises, you know? It's different. I think I'm done here. I'm probably going to head back to the hotel and just figure out what I'm going to do. So I want to maximize my time here because I spent a lot of money on this suite. While we wait, I'm going to take a nice bath. I cannot wait to try it out. This is going to be so relaxing after a long day. All right, thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, of do you want me to set this up on your table? Yes, please. Thank you Very so good. Much. My pleasure. This is your mac and cheese. This Ooh. is your spaghetti. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna demolish that. Isn't that so beautiful? This is perfect size for me because I'm gonna eat all of it. And we got three warm cookies. Let's do a little test to make sure they're actually warm. All right, they're a little bit cold, but that's okay. Because they gave me a side of milk. That's all that matters. We also got some asparagus and just bread. Can never go wrong with that. We got some margarita spaghetti. And lastly, we got mac and cheese. Presentation's a 10, but we still gotta do a taste test. Cheers. Mmm. oh my gosh. This lasagna, I kid you not, is a 10 for me. It's getting pretty late, it's about that time I should probably go to bed, but I'm not gonna lie, I'm kinda scared. I've been hearing a lot of weird noises, not only coming out of this room, but outside as well. I feel like there's a lot of crazy activity going on out there that I want no part of. I devised the perfect plan to get myself out of this situation right here. I'm all alone, I wanna connect with some of my friends. So luckily for me, there's some YouTubers that recently just moved out here that I could probably go visit and hopefully they let me spend the night. I don't know if this is considered cheating in this challenge, but at this point, I, I really don't care. All right, I think I came to the right address. I'm not too sure. I actually got sent this a long time ago, so they have no idea I'm actually coming right now. If they answer, I'll go in, catch up for a little bit, but I also want to ask them a very important question. Open sesame? Oh, it's kind of open already. Yo. Bro. <laughs> What? Hey, bro. Frazier, what are you doing? Yo, what's good, guys? Bro, that is so <laughs> random, bro. Jesus. Bro, how are you? Man? Good, bro. How are you? <laughs> Chilling, bro. No way he's here. I just had to pull up, you know what I'm saying? How do you Vegas? know where we live? Well, listen, I have like, you know, my connects, but I'm here now. That's all that matters. Welcome, welcome to the crib, bro, I guess. Bro, this is beautiful, bro. How are you? Good. You look great. Dude, I grew a little bit, huh? I know, you did. Just seeing you two in my peripherals is like nuts. Whoa, you, this I don't is my even POV. know what's going on. Is it, you definitely knew about this. Nah, 100%. No. You had no idea. Or Jarvis or someone. He's getting a massage right yeah, now. No, he had no idea. I, I literally just pulled up. I just like wanted to say what's up, what, catch yeah, up for a little what bit. What are you doing here? Like in Vegas. You live in California. I do. <laughs> yeah. Well, you got that right. Yeah. 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 Yo, so I don't know. I just wanted to pull up, chill, check out the new place. Yeah. This is beautiful, bro. I, I can't believe you guys like made the move out here. You guys are going hard. You look different too, bro. Appreciate you look good as f Wait, bro. Wait, bro. bro I, yeah, I just have like a quick question. I don't want to like take too much of your guys' time. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I know you guys probably want to sleep. Oh, okay, you can do a little house tour? Is yeah, that what you want? I would love that. Is that what you're gonna ask? No, no, but we could do that. Yeah. Let's okay. do it. Oh shit, man. I was up oh, there, Charlotte. Oh, Charlotte? Hey. What's good? How you been? Great. I good? Do too now. I see that. <laughs> Yo. Hi, nice Hi. to meet you. Nice to meet you too. What's up, Hook? Frazier went he went on a, like a two week trip uh, to Nepal and uh, he came back with these. So I don't know how he got them, but he got them. Just, Legend. Yeah, it's good. It's pretty cool. You thing. survived that? Yeah. And then, uh, <laughs> no, we got, oh, wait. Oh, you know what we do have? What? We have, like, every single flavor of Prime. Oh, oh yo. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Bro, you got the lemonade, too? Oh, my God. Look what we actually do have. Uh, oh, 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 
Oh, you got the one up. Shout out to the boy. <laughs> Yo, by the way, I'm gonna give my honest review. Okay. So I am a lover of sour, sour candy. Like it doesn't. It's not sour. Like sour candy is not that sour to me. Of course. You know what I mean? Yeah. Just because I love sour. It is very sour. Yep. But I could definitely handle it. I could say the same. Yep. I I think like I could I, just breeze past it. You can't. No. <laughs> what do you mean? Yeah, I have one of them. Fraser and Jarvis like spat it out. It's, it's like that. Bro, yeah. I mean, I'm gonna try three for a TikTok, but like okay. one of them, bro. You should try like a hundred. I need to do something real quick, bro. Hold yeah, on. you go to you go to school that shit. Okay. Wow. Okay. <laughs> We're chilling. That was fire, bro. <laughs> Yo, okay, honestly, like, let's just cut to the chase, bro. Like, I actually came here for, like, a specific reason. I'm I actually- want something, bro. Listen, bro, come on. No, not, not, over. no, no, like, we can still kick it, but I really have an important question. I'm supposed to be at, like, a motel right now. Like, I was just thinking if I can, like, crash here. Oh, like, sleep? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, oh. Yeah, like, like, uh, well, like, the whole night. Yeah, like, I wouldn't do, like, half the night. Like, I would just, like, sleep here, wake Can up. Can I actually be honest? Yeah. Like, for real? Uh-huh. There's no room. Jarvis's friend's here. Frazier's friend's here. What about... The thing is, it's a brand new couch. We don't really want people sleeping on it. Cause okay. Of body odors. I can respect... Know. I mean, I can... Yeah. We don't even sell that. We can do this. All right, all right. Actually, you know what? Let's play a game. What's the game? You make two shots. Three shots in a row. I can stay? You can stay in my room. And Your I'll, room? And I will sleep out here. Dude. Okay, that's a bet. That's a bet. Let's do it. Like one, two. Okay. Yeah, you're not. Yeah, I mean, that's it. You have to get two in a row. Uh, so what now? Like, do I? I mean, I mean, uh, there, it's a pretty nice street. So. It's gated and yeah. there's security. Oh, yeah, you're good. It's no, gated. I mean, there's you got to flex that. I just want to stay with the boy. You know what I'm saying? If I can't, I'll, I mean. No, I'm saying for your safety, because not. Oh, yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah. So yeah, 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 yeah. No, so you should, that, you you should probably will. just go figure that out. All right. All right, bro. And I'm pretty sure you can post me like pillows and. Something like that, bro. Like I mean, it. I have to go back to the I'll give you family. water, though, because you need to stay hard, Jared. Please. Yeah. Just knock Sense on the door. It's hot out there, bro. It's Vegas. Well, yeah. I'm not going to stay in the street. I'm going back to the motel. That's better. Uh, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, they have water there for sure. Oh, yeah, for sure. Right, well, yeah, I mean, you it's, nice. it was nice seeing you. I <laughs> wish I could have wish I could have kicked it longer if I made that shot. But Take you know what I'm saying? Take it easy, bro. 100%. All right. Take it easy, brother. Peace. I really wonder how Destiny's experience is going right now. I'm sure it's extravagant. I'm not really too disappointed in my experience here. It wasn't the worst. <laughs> Good night, y'all. All right, y'all. It's the next morning. I am literally burning right now from how hot it is. And from the looks of it, I'm kind of screwed. I'm just in the middle of nowhere. Currently making my way back to civilization. I have no money to spend on an Uber because I wasted all my budget. Ugh, I still got a long way to go, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know which hotel you guys enjoyed the best. I mean, I don't really think it was a fair comparison, but nonetheless, show some love down below. I love you guys all so much. Keep it simple. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.